Look at this purple hair psycho. So in today's news, we've had more of these woke kids go into these galleries where they keep very famous, beautiful paintings and try to get their point across. Well today, these two little psychopaths just stop oil through tomato soup at one of Van Gogh's most famous paintings. Thank God the painting was covered in glass, so the painting's fine. There's just some poor guy who's got to clean it. I guess I'm lucky it wasn't hot chili day today. And then I guess they glued their hands to the wall thinking that'll really stop people from taking them. I would have ripped their freaking hand right off. This is just more of the, you know, if you're new to me on this channel, I complain a lot about, you know, just things that I don't like. And wokeness in this whole global, uh, you know, awareness situation, is, there's like two things that I think this, that are destroying culture, they're destroying young people, and this right here is a prime example. Now, stupid stuff has been going on for generations with young people, but now with this whole woke culture, culture and then having woke culture kids find this whole new avenue with climate change, now there's these two right here, we're talking about fossil fuel, uh, it needs to stop being used, which makes no freaking sense because, you know, everyone's talking about go electric that's great but you know we're not there with our technology yet 100 percent the painting was an estimated 84.2 million dollars of course these two little numbskulls definitely do not have that kind of dough laying around so i guess what i'm trying to say here is that this is a very interesting little situation we have here that's probably going to continue to happen i mean these little creeps have been all around you know the world doing this in places where you know paintings are kept and trying to be heard and this is just more of it right here and I, I just find it so so hilarious that these kids think they're gonna make a difference they really have no clue what is going on in the world we literally are on the foot steps of nuclear war and these kids right here are worried about fossil fuels being used and how it's changing climates and you know it's like does any, has anybody looked at a freaking history book you know you can easily google google you know past storms does anybody remember this one El Nino. i mean it doesn't help that our president here in the united states is always talking about global you know we've never seen hurricanes like this we've never seen rain like this you know, as he poops his pants. But it's just more of the same thing. It's just agendas with this woke culture being pushed. And this is just really sad that these kids would destroy some, something from a, an amazing artist long, long ago who has many different paintings, who was a very troubled artist and who took their life and who's just, who, who, who just has done so much for art in general I, obviously I, I love art so this really just this really just pisses me off I'm gonna be really honest so anyway let me know what you think about this do you agree that this is completely crazy or do you go well you know I kind of get their point I see what they're doing right here I started it at Juilliard and I completely understand that fossil fuels are taking you know whatever just let me know what you think here but you know I, I don't know I'm gonna end it bye everyone fart noise <laughs>